What's go- Yeah, there I am. What's going on in Sly Tiger? Who's Sly Tiger Survival? And... I just got back from the shooting range. Shot my underfolder. Here it is. I shot the shit out of my M70 AB2. I've had it for about a year. And God damn, I love this rifle. I think uh, my best advice for to get something that you really like and to actually use the shit out of it is try to have more than one rifle and get a junk gun like an underfolder or an old washer or something. And you will fucking love that gun more than your nicest gun that you have. And, uh, God, it's been great. It's been great. But, um, yeah, it's been almost exactly one year. But this, this video is not about, um, it's not about underfolders. This is about, if you look at the news and look on, uh, Black Friday national news, you'll see El Paso, of all places. This was in the Northeast those of you that don't know, don't know about El Paso, there's like a big ass mountain and then they have the pass and the other side of the mountains is in Mexico and that's where the conquistadors went through. But anyway, El Paso is built into a U around the mountain and uh, I live on the west side and uh, you have downtown or central, you have northeast, the far east, and you have, you know, the west side west side or northwest as well but i live on the west side and the northeast usually has military people and older people and it also has a few of course just like most military bases a little um hood a little ghetto fight area outside the base and uh that walmart for black friday had a uh, bunch of incidents i mean they had a city police. When they said it was a security that got into or got hit by that man, it was a city policeman. Um, and God, I feel bad for that guy. I'm not a cop. I don't like a lot of cops. You know, they shouldn't get any privileges that I, you know, anyone else has. And uh, you know, badges don't give people, you know, special rights. And uh, anyway. <laughs> These the people were acting like fucking animals, and you know it, it makes you think. Imagine shit. It's a fan. I watched a thing about Russia, and they would have meat and tobacco riots, and uh, Jesus Christ, that's over flat screen TVs. You know, in my opinion, I'm no political science major like my brother is, but that is capitalism. The dark side of capitalism at its finest, you know, when people act like animals on Black Friday. And, uh, you know, I fuck communism, but I don't see that much of a difference. So, uh, you know, I, I might be a moron there, but Jesus Christ. I mean, how crazy can shit get? But watch the footage. I'll post the link on uh, what I've been watching. But people will stampede. They'll open up the doors. And people will just stampede. Someone will fall. And they'll just trample all over them. Like they're garbage. And uh. What would you do. In a situation like that. In a. You know. <clears throat> say your child needs something. And you have to. You're somehow stuck in the Black Friday chaos. What would you do. I mean. Especially if you have family members nearby. I mean. If you fire into a crowd you're gonna take out you know innocent people and I guess in a situation like that it's good to you know have a um you know some kind of um self-defense melee weapon and not you know just a pistol or something like that but um I just don't know I guess you just have to fight and try to get the hell out of there but uh I mean I think you know an SHTF you know, and riots and stampedes like that, it'll get ugly. And, you know, being in the right place at the right time is crucial. So, uh, just watch these videos. You know, this was Black Friday, so it was about a day ago. And, uh, 
I mean, people were camping out there for two days. And, you know, imagine, imagine, quit pumpkin. Imagine what they would do, you know, when the lights go out. Or not even a big SHTF, just a localized SHTF. So, uh, you know, I, I really think it's good to have, you know, a regular standard size fighting rifle. But, uh, I really think there's a place for these, you know, um, grab and go rifles or, you know, compact AR pistols and AK pistols to put in a vehicle and keep in there in case you get caught up in some crazy shit, you know, like some Ferguson riots. Which I heard the Ferguson riots wasn't that big of a deal once you got outside of Ferguson. And then they just tried to blow that up. But, you know, Black Friday, people get aggressive. More people are aggressive nowadays because uh, the economy sucks so bad. Like, just at red lights, you, you feel, I could feel people behind me just, they, you know, once the light turns green, they're so stressed and pressed for time and broke as fuck and... God knows what else kind of crap that they have going on at home. So, uh, I guess when events like Black Friday, you know, occur, people break down and get aggressive and you see the evil, um, malicious animal um, side of humanity. So, God, and that's not even shit, it's a fan. So, anyway, this is Sly Tiger. Thanks for listening and take care.